Mm. This game is automatic, supersonic, hypnotic, funky, fresh. Wait, no, that would be one two step. This is one two switch. Man, this thing is tiny. Not the first time I've heard that. Now, to me, when it comes to a game night party at the house, Nintendo consoles are the way to go, always offering up a variety of local multiplayer action. Mario Party, Mario Kart, Wii Sports, Wii Play, Wii Party, Wii Party U, Nintendo Land, Game & Wario, Wii Music. Well, maybe not Wii Music. So with the launch of the Nintendo Switch, we've got... 1-2 Switch, a party game that's really only for two players at a time. Luckily, my buddy Dave was nice enough to come over and make a fool of himself with me. Yes, that's two Daves, so there's no confusion. Ready to play some 1-2 Switch, Dave? Let's do it. All right, Dave. <laughs> Let's go, Dave. Let's go. 1-2 one, two, one, two, Switch! 1-2 Switch. Here we go. Let's have some fun. What have we done? <laughs> One Two Switch offers a variety of quick mini games, 28 in all. And when I say quick, I mean quick. In fact, some of the games are so fast that it takes longer to set them up than to actually play them. Now you can pick and choose individual games to play. You can use the shuffle mode to randomize the selection, or you can party it up in team mode. Now, this is a super dumbed-down board game mode. You split up into a left and right team and send up players to compete in random minigames. Win the game, and you get to spin the wheel to make your way around the board. And that's it. That's what 1-2 Switch offers. So let's hope these minigames are amazing. Let's take a look. Stretch it out. All right, Spread it out. <laughs> Run hard and raise your Joy-Con when you feel it vibrate. All right. Okay. What about vibrating? On your marks. Get set. Okay. We don't look at the screen. Don't look at the screen. Why are you holding your breath? Raise your Joy-Con. Raise the flag. No, I'm not gonna waste your time and go over every single mini game in great detail. I mean, it's quite a list. I got a list right here. Got air guitar, baby, ball counting, baseball, beach flag, boxing gym, copy dance, dance off, eating contest, fake draw, gorilla, joy con rotation, milk, plate spin, quick draw, runway, safe crack, samurai training, shave, signal flag, sneaky dice, soda shake, sword fight, table tennis, telephone, treasure chest, wizard, and zen. This fencing, this is fencing. Each other in the eye. And then I guess we just, okay. I wasn't totally paying attention. Guard and let go to swipe. You know what? Whatever you think works. Oh, we're on. We're in. Oh, okay. We're in. Someone needs to do some CG and put some swords in our hands. I'm not 100% sure I knew how to play that one. Wait, Tommy, your score was fabulous. I exposed myself big time. Yeah? Well fought. I'll just talk about a couple of my favorites or the worsts. The worsts, there's some of them. The dancing games are fun, especially the copy dance where you take turns doing poses and the other person has to, on beat, give that pose. That was a fun one. I also like the plain old dance-off, which is really just 
gyrate as much as you can to earn those points. Gyrate, people! Nothing wrong with that. Quick Draw, of course, is a fan favorite, and it's what they use in the advertising when 1-2-Switch was starting to be announced. But there's not much to it. Steady. You can stare at your mouth. Fire! Oh! Uh -oh. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Got him! Well done. Well. Not too bad. Let's see, let's see the timing of that. Oh! You got me in the head though. A little head yeah. shot there. I went right for the right for the chat, right for my eye level. Just right there. That's it. That's it. It's over. There's not rounds. There's not best two out of three. There's <sighs> potential. Wasted. Safe crack was actually pretty fun. You got to go head to head trying to crack open the safe to get that cash or gold bars hidden inside, and you would feel the little vibration as you hit the right pin inside the lock mechanism. That was neat. Boxing gym was pretty good. You got to do a little punch -a but be careful because you don't want to punch each other in the fist. That'll hurt. Straight. Uppercut. Straight. Uppercut. Straight. Hook. Straight. Hook. Oh. Straight. Hook. Oh. Rapid fire! Keep it up! Punch! 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 <laughs> In a real match, I play dirty. I would look. Play dirty. Uppercut! Hook! Hook! Straight! Uppercut! Straight! Uppercut! Straight! Not looking good for me. Not looking Straight. good. Hook! Straight! Hook! Rapid fire! What? You just might be a future champ. I still lost. That, cr that was crazy, the end there. That was rapid fire, you. Yeah. Wizard was cool if you want to Harry Potter it up because that's totally what it's doing with the countering and just, uh, just do more of the uh, and you'll win. Like real wizards. <laughs> when you hear the cue, thrust your wands at each other. Wizards! Thrust your wand at your opponent. Oh, Reach what? To an opponent's thrust to counter attack. Nice counter. <laughs> Black Mage style. Yeah. <laughs> this is tiring. Halt! You're on your way to becoming a true oh, wizard. Look at that. That is how you wizard, my friend. Now, one of my favorite mini-games from 1-2-Switch is Shave, which is kind of ironic because I didn't shave before filming this, which I should have. It's actually kind of gross if you really get into it because you are taking the Joy-Con and you are just rubbing it, rubbing it on your faces. And if you have greasy, nasty friends, their greasy, nasty faces will be on your Joy-Con. And those things ain't cheap! Dirtying them up with your grease faces. What a waste of money. Waste of the hot cash. All right, so I think it's time to shave. I'm pretty good with the shave, but Start. Dave needs some shave. Shave Dave, welcome back to another episode of Shave Dave. <laughs> this is gross. Like, you better hope that your friends aren't gross. It's time. Because you're gonna be getting Joy Con face goo airwear. The button is. Oh, yeah, that's good. Move your Joy Con gently along your face, following the curves and contours. Whoa. Well, I felt like I wasn't totally ready, but. Face each other. <laughs> it's a little bit of a, Three, a little patchy. Two, one, right? Oh, wait, face each other. Start. Jeez. This is really kind of gross, I'll be honest. I'm glad I'm the first one doing this. <laughs> that you know of. <laughs> Gotta get that time. Uh, oh. Uh, feels great. Come on. 100%. Hey, 100%. Look at that. Look at that. A Fu Manchu. Nice. <laughs> look at that. Every little taste. <laughs> Can you tell? I know what I'm doing. 
I don't. You don't have enough experience with shaving. No. But it was really fun because you got to. It, it felt like you were holding an electric razor. How did they do it? That HD rumble, that's how. And speaking of the HD rumble, it was pretty underutilized. There were some games where it's like, oh yeah, I, I feel it. It feels real. It feels real. But uh, it doesn't go too far. So those are the games. Some aren't too bad, but it's not enough to really draw you in. A major issue Dave and I had with playing 1-2-Switch was the forced tutorials. You have to sit through each full-length tutorial for every minigame. Then in future playthroughs, you can skip them. This slows everything down. These games are not that complicated, and we spent more time watching these color-coordinated weirdos play the games than we did. Plus, certain games require different setups for the Joy-Con. Grab the tablet, lay them on a table, attach the straps, take off the straps, attach the straps. And we all know how easy it is to use the straps. See, right now, I don't even know. So you hold this, lock is up, so push it down to unlock it, but then also... Hold on. <laughs> oh, there we go. The big mission statement of 1-2-Switch is to look at each other in the eye, not the screen. Hold on now, this is a video game, right? Not a board game? Huh. I'd probably still get more out of a game like Stretch Out Sam than 1-2-Switch anyway. I'm Stretch Out Sam, your waiter! Whoa! Don't tip me! Stretch Out Sam's a wacky waiter, his arms like an elevator. Put your dishes on his tray, better hope they're gonna stay. Whoa. Stretch his arm, goes up and up, add a dish, a bowl, a cup. Stretch, be careful, let him slip! Stretch Out Sam's gonna tip! Okay, I should have just reviewed that game. It's amusing that the table tennis minigame actually has some fun visuals. Even if you are supposed to awkwardly stare at your opponent and make them uncomfortable which 1-2-Switch is masterful at. More games should give the rest of the party goers something to look at in addition to the goofiness of the player's actions. That makes it a nice. party. And this is absolutely a party game, but nothing more. There's no one-player mode, so if you're sitting home alone and you haven't thrown this gem in the trash yet, you won't be able to play it, aside from the eating contest. Go! <laughs> One Two Switch should have been a pack-in game with the console. We know that. And at most, this could be a $20 physical release, more like a $10 eShop game. At best, One Two Switch is a casual party game. Get a group together, eat some chips and dip, and run this game in the background. It'll definitely have a comical experience for you with people trying to play these mini-games. But it's not a deep and rich experience you're looking for, unless you want the ultimate cow-milking simulation. I hate myself. And I don't think anybody wants that. team and challenge your friends. You can now play Shuffle. When you're not sure what game to play, why not pick one at random? Have fun playing! <laughs>